Hey guys, Eclipse14 here, and welcome back to Let's Play Kirby's Adventure. Alright! Grape Garden 5 is up next, which starts off the Grape Palace section. Unfortunately, I'm at 1 HP, which is a bit of a struggle. But uh, I am going to try here, so let's take a look and see, just kind of see how we do here. Oh, that kind of helps things out. Out of my way, losers! I'm coming through! Look at these jumping skills. No contest whatsoever. Get wrecked. Let's deal with that. I don't need the throw power up in this case. I actually need the sword power up here. But uh, go through here, and you get yourself one of these things, as well as a pass through wall. Once you go up here, just kind of hit the very top of this thing, and just stay at the very top to avoid the spikes until you reach this area. Let go, and uh, cut the blocks. There's your extra life! Cool stuff! Alright, we're done here, unfortunately. So, exit. And, uh, there you go. That pretty much takes care of things, and enter the next door to reach the official gates of the Great Palace. Which, uh... Just jump in and... Oh, crap! Well, so much for needing this, unfortunately, because it's not gonna work too well. Get rid of you. Shoot. So much for trying to keep that stable. Oh, come on! At least I got rid of everybody, but ouch. Uh, that's not good. I'm still at one health. Just break through everybody and... Gotta blow through that, somehow. So go through that, and I'm just gonna slowly take my time here. Because this is going to suck otherwise. I mean, not that it already sucks. I have one freaking HP. But there's a little passage through here to continue through. This part is very, very annoying. Glide up here and just stay up top and goes your way down. Now we have this part, which is also a pain in the ass. I have to wait until this goes up. Right about there is the right time. Decompress, and there we go. More or less, kind of do the same thing up here. Just stay at the very top, run through, wait for that to go through, decompress, and you're done. This area is more just time it right, and you're good. Stay right here, at the very corner, and run. Decompress. Got it! That's how you do it. Easy stuff. Although, yeah, it is really tight, because one point was all that was the difference between me and getting destroyed. At least I made it. <laughs> and there's Grape Garden 6, which, uh... Uh, I mean, I may as well... Chris, what else am I gonna do? But anyway, there's a little spot right here. Keep your distance. There we go. Got through that. There we go. Just slowly but surely take care of everything, because you gotta blow up a bunch of bombs. But I gotta be really, really careful all the time, because otherwise this sucks. Alright, that's handled. All right, let's just let's just quickly get out of here, because right up there is a uh, thing, which is good. Blow that up directly up. I at least have some breathing room. And a sword really helps. Is there anything over on this end? No. Okay. I was just kind of curious. I just wanted to be. I wanted to take caution, but I didn't want to screw myself over, because if I screwed myself over, that's a problem. Alright, we'll go through here, and there's the door out. Go inside. Oh, you to deal with. Alright, 
Alright, at least I got rid of him without getting damaged. Go through here and... Oh, crap. Cut through these guys. And around here so... Hey! Right there is your fifth switch of the game. And there's the Warp Star Station. Deal with that. We're done. Only to come back to those guys again. Oh, shoot. I mean, at least I can just take the sword as is and be done with it. Alright. Kind of dodge everything. There's the exit. There's another one of these things where I just uh, run straight through the door. Oh. Uh, what the? Oh, wait a minute. I need the stone power to break these things. And of course, there's the one. There's the extra life where you just break that. You can break that to cause that. That sends everything up as a one up. So, uh. That may have been an error. You can easily get that up and just swallow it up, though. I just screwed it up. Nothing that matters, because I don't really need extra life of that much anyway. Screw the pepper. I'm just gonna jump up and be done with 4 6. Hey, there's my second number one! Finally! And I got most of my health back after starting from 1 HP at the start. And of course there's the boss, which means this is going to be an extra long episode. And this one is one of the suckier ones of the game. Well, here we go. The top concern, there's Krakow. Get the high jump and just use it. Keep using it all the way up to the very top. Please be careful of all the enemies. Just stay up. And he will dodge you. Eventually, he'll climb up, and then we face Krakow himself in his cloud form. High jump actually works pretty well against him, as long as he's not using lightning. Ouch. I'm not doing so well. Darn it! I lost my ability, which means I gotta wait. There's my high jump again. And there we go, I can at least whack him. See, a high jump makes him pretty easy, you just gotta ramp straight into him without taking a hit yourself. Because you only have a slight bit of invulnerability doing this. Ouch. Damn it, I'm really gonna screw myself here, aren't I? Yep, of course. I may as well take it, since I'm doing this length anyway. Well, so much for a perfect run all the way through the game, but, uh, hey, I got to the end of stage four before I lost a life. And Christ, I may as well after what I just did through this area. I just, uh, I just couldn't do it. Last through. I got way too conservative. That was probably my issue. Instead of just blowing him up entirely, like I should have. Suck it! <sighs> Took a life, unfortunately, but hey, I got the fourth piece. And I may as well just go with it. And with that, we reach level 5, which is Yogurt Yard. Climb up this mountain and, uh... Oops. Well done. Alright, 10 minutes of recording time. And we're done. Well, I'm gonna just close things here and that'll be it. So, uh, I don't need high jump anymore, so I'll just let that run away and be done with it. 
With that all said, uh, I'm gonna close this longer episode than usual. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.